welcome to the vlog. I have Eli's two month appointment. I almost said week, that's how tired I am. And for whatever reason, I made it at 9.45 in the morning. I fully regret it right now because last night was not great. The night before, that was not great. I'm dead. Anyway, hope y'all are doing good. Thank you all for watching and enjoying and joining me on the chaos. My grandma will be up here in like 15 minutes, so I kind of have to hurry. But yeah, last night was rough. He just wouldn't go to sleep. <laughs> and he didn't want to sleep in his bassinet. He kept waking up every time, like five minutes after I'd put him in there, he'd wake up and get him back asleep. I'd try to let him lay with me. Five minutes later, he'd wake up. It was really close to 11, I think, before he finally went to sleep. And the reason that was really bad is because the morning of yesterday, he woke up before five, uh, didn't wanna go back to sleep. So I was up before 5 a.m. And of course he fell back asleep until like nine, but I was awake. Um, so I was up from before five to 11. Mama. That was just makes for a really long day. But I'm really excited to share that I have officially made the decision to start eating healthy, try to get this weight off. I don't know if I can call it baby weight or not. I'm about 20 pounds over my usual weight, like my average. I usually sit around the 170, 175 area. So right now I'm like one, 95 ish too so i've been doing really well for the past couple days and i've lost a, a few pounds I'm not counting anything i'm just trying to eat healthy to see the weight come off in just a couple of days like that is really encouraging so now i'm like let's do this i do want to stop at the store on my way home from the doctor we'll see how eli is doing i need to get some like shampoo for him he's got a lot of cradle crap right now a couple of other things that help me like stay on track we're just gonna go with mascara this morning. Six months old. I don't know. Yeah, I know. He's like, so big. That's some cradle cap now. Yeah. Yeah. The whole thing over there. So. And usually they do cradle cap. You're only two months. Did you yeah. know that? You're not. And then I'll see you back when you're four months. Mm -hmm. His eyebrows are. It's the eyebrows. They're very expressive. Oh no. Oh, no. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Okay. You always feel so bad when they have to get the shots. It's so sad. It's 14 pounds and I'm pretty sure it said 21 and a half inches long. And the length is like in the 92nd percentile or something. And the weight is 85th percentile. Like I swear this kid is like, he feels like a six month old baby. Like it's crazy. I'm glad that is over with. Um, we're going to the store. I need to get him some cradle cap, stuff for his cradle cap. I was telling my mom on the way here that I wish that like by your third or fourth kid, like you could just weigh them. Like if you don't need to get a shot, instead of coming to the doctor, I wish that you could just weigh them and measure them <laughs> and let them know. But I understand like why they have all this stuff in place so that they can catch any, you know, neglect going on or if there's any issues going on. But it's just like, it's a big job to bring a kid all the way to the doctors, a baby, all the way to the doctor, just to get weighed and measured and tell them how often they're eating. It's like, and I told the lady, I don't know. I don't know how often I'm feeding this kid, but clearly he is huge. <laughs> He's eating enough. Um, so we're doing good. I think we're fine. He's so good at that. Show me your putting your feet up on your bike. I know. Show me your feet up. Yeah, I know you can do it. Go fast, go fast. Pick your feet up. Close. Yeah. 
Oh yeah, I think you're ready for one with pedals. No, you just have, you will have to get you a new bike with pedals. See how long you can keep them up. Jeez, whoa. I have been killing it at dinner lately with trying new recipes and cooking like every night and not doing like cheap stuff like chicken nuggets. But tonight we're doing chicken nuggets. <laughs> um, chicken nuggets and mac and cheese. We got these pots and pans uh, with the removable handle off of Amazon. I think they're so cool. It makes it really easy to stack them together. Um, so check them out. They were like $70 like, and they are really good. Eli is still asleep. He went back to sleep shortly after that clip of me getting him out of his swing. He nursed, he went back to sleep. Vaccine days can be like that where they're just very exhausted from getting so much in their body like that. But yeah, he's still asleep. I did check on him because I was like, oh, maybe, maybe I should check on him. He's good, he's breathing. After that, we're having baked beans and corn because I don't have any mac and cheese. I thought I had some, but we don't. How it works. I love you too. I don't want. I didn't give you ketchup. Yesterday I picked up some makeup. I'm now on a quest to find the perfect foundation for me. I usually just use a CC cream. This is Mary Kay. This is what I've been using for years. And I don't really love full coverage for just like everyday stuff. I just feel like with full coverage you have to really do a lot of work to make it look natural. So for me, I just like a medium coverage, which is what I got. This is the NYX Bear With Me Blur. I got this shade Fair because clearly I'm a vampire. You can see I have some blemishes going on. So of course I want them to cover up the blemishes, but I don't want it to be like that full coverage cakey look. I can already tell this might be too light for me. This is really, really white really white <laughs> so i either put too much or this is just too light for me which i would never expect <laughs> i don't know if this is a complete you know fail or anything because i want to try again and put less makeup on i do like the color after i put everything on so maybe i just need less so i'm gonna try that next time so yesterday we tried vanilla protein coffee it was okay yeah. I want to try that with like an already pre-made protein shake because that's how I've been seeing it made. So today I'm going to make a chocolate coffee blender. So I'm going to like put ice in it. We're going to have, I have the chocolate protein peanut butter powder. So I think it's going to be good. I think it's going to be good. Filled coffee. I still have not made any cold brew. I'm not on it. That's like half a scoop. Okay. Peanut butter powder. Almond milk. Are you making hey guys, please stop fighting. I'm making a huge mess. Oh my gosh! Bill! You want to play? You play you got yeah. it. Top it! No, you're not, because it's moldy. That's disgusting. Alright, who needs whipped cream? Just drink it. Yeah, that's good. It's really good. I could probably deal without the ice though. That's definitely way too much.
extra extra mad he won't nurse like yesterday after his shots he would not nurse like he was so like no I'm mad at you but yeah I feel like this vlog is probably at its end it I feel like it's been a long one so um, I'm gonna go ahead and end it I hope you enjoyed it if you liked it give it a thumbs up and let me know if like you need me to end the vlog because I've been thinking about that let me know the last video I posted I just kind of ended it and with music and like didn't say anything so let me know how you like that do you care how I end the vlog how many actually make it to the end of the vlog like I feel like I need to officially end the video or it feels weird but also like I hate ending the vlog <laughs> like I hate doing it if I can find a more creative way to end the vlog without having to say bye uh it's over um let me know if like you're cool with that because like if I could do that I think it would make my life a little bit easier that makes sense I don't have to talk to you about ending the vlog. Anyway, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.